hello hello and welcome back to another adonis reaction video this right here is not really a reaction this is actually informative as you can see from the title you already know who it's about what it's about which is going to not waste any time and just jump right into this i saw it when it came up on my news feed but now that he's covering it it got to be something really really crazy cut i don't know what's going on but let's get into it all right so he's talking about antonio brown again so here we go all right so well, first and foremost i don't even wear glasses i just want to take them off my face as if i'm a disappointed parent but one way or another if you guys were unfamiliar let me catch you up to speed antonio brown is back in the news again for absolute tomfoolery it Here seems as if every single month or every other month, there's a new Antonio Brown story. And the last time that I had spoke about it, I talked about my disappointment in how Antonio Brown has since been carrying himself. But moreover, my disappointment in the people around him not breathing life or truth or understanding or any kind of discipline into this man. Now, granted, he's a grown adult. He can do what he wants. But like I constantly drive home. This is a father of five, six, five, whatever the case may be. Five or six children. Hmm. For some odd reason, I'm thinking he had probably like two or three, but okay. This man has several different children, two of which that are definitely on social media and can see the tomfoolery that he does on a day by day week oh, by Lord. week month by month year by year basis and he continues to carry himself as if there's no repercussions for his actions you lack of discipline in his latest scandal <laughs> it was found that he posted on his snapchat story who still uses snapchat but that's not the conversation he posted on his snapchat a lot of people use snapchat too a lot of people trust me there's a lot of people that use snapchat still i mean i don't use it as much as the next person but there is a whole lot of people that use snapchat too still so i don't know what's the whole deal about that with him but nonetheless let's keep moving story of him receiving a little bit of fellatio from his child's mother also evidently really? twitter was talking about there was a posting of explicit video of him sliding underneath the labia minora infiltrating the labia major bypassing the hymen invading the vaginal canal you know greeting the graphen hold up bro like i know antonio brown did not do all that shit i know he did not do all that stuff i'm i'm serious like are you serious right now? Only thing that came up on my phone was saying that he was suspended. Didn't tell me, didn't tell me. I didn't read into what it was or how it was done or whatever. I know he was suspended off of Snapchat, but I ain't know anything about all this stuff was going on on Twitter. Like, wow. Like he, like he, he named this video right. He wilding yo for real. Berg spot telling the clitoral region, "Hello, how are you? How you doing?" And entering and exiting, and entering and exiting, and entering cool. and exiting her vulva region until there was a little bit of vaginal secretion that happened to come down the form of an orgasm. Whatever the case may be, really, this man was wilding on social media. What? Basically, Antonio Brown was on Snapchat letting it all hang out. Tell me I did not just see that. However, after the releasing of these videos, if I'm not mistaken, two days ago, yesterday, he came forth in a tweet claiming that he was hacked. Saying he was hacked. <laughs> wait, wait, wrong tweet, but he's certainly right. Quit playing. I didn't do this stuff. This is not me. I'm fighting for my life. With this. Really? Now here's the thing. There could be legitimacy to him being hacked. Several different individuals have been hacked before. Here's where I think there's a bit of dissension in And I think he I think I know where he's going at with this. Cause my thing is, okay, if you've been hacked, he probably gonna say the same thing. If you've been hacked, then okay. Chances are you probably gonna be locked out of your account. 
Secondly, you probably would not have access to it. Three, if that, why of all videos, why would you, like, why would somebody actually go in there and just post that specific video? Like, don't know how to each mean even do all of that. They they want some information out of your account. They wouldn't sit up there and post a video and everything. And plus on top of that, they would have to go it's either it's either they either can go inside the phone and get it, or either they can sit up there and or either you already have it on Snapchat. It's not the fact that the person put it up there. It's either you have it on Snapchat or either you just or somebody actually like went in your phone wirelessly and doing it ain't nobody got time for all that most likely he probably sit up there and post it he trying to claim he got hacked but i don't think he got hacked him claiming that he was hacked do you really believe that antonio brown didn't put this up this is the same antonio brown throwing candy dicks at his child's mother Charles, he got a bag <gasps> of dicks fucking basic get up there that really man, get up there the same antonio brown I did not know he did that. Who months ago was putting his bare booty cheeks in a woman's face in a pool. Tell me how my ass tastes. Okay. I can see my really? Face. The same Antonio Brown who on that very Snapchat app on a bi-weekly basis, if I'm not mistaken, on his very story gives requests and lyrical innuendo regarding entering and exiting ladies' vulva regions and possibly messing up their spinal while he enters and exits from behind. If you ain't nasty, don't at me. I've been working all day. I like to run the screens to this talk out and come through and blow your back out. I hope that's okay. I can't leave you alone. Nah, that ain't it, y'all. The very Antonio Brown. Bruh, like all this stuff. I haven't even, half this stuff I haven't even seen. I ain't even know he was out there doing this show. Something's wrong with him. Like something's seriously wrong with ABO, for real. I don't even know what to say about it anymore. Brown, who's had scandal after 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 scandal. And you know all the in Exhibit A, you know all these so-called scandals that he got going on and everything like that. They're legitimate sites, TMZ Sports legitimate sites no no bs sites or anything like that it's like legitimate sites like it's always something with him after scandal and after more. scandal after scandal after scandal after scandal after scandal after scandal after Ooh. scandal after scandal after scandal after scandal after much. scandal after scandal, after scandal, you get the idea. It's the yeah. ego. I don't have an ego because, like, bro, I'm just trying to win. With all of that being said, it's incredibly difficult to sit here and believe that you were a victim of being hacked and having those personal videos, the personal stuff. photos released without your consent. Numerous individuals who saw this go live did not think, man, what was he thinking? Man, what the hell happened to him? Man, somebody must have broken into his phone. We all looked at the news and said, that seems right about on target. I'm exactly. not surprised Antonio Brown would do something like this. Because look at the different things in which he's done. Oh, flashback. Scandal after scandal after scandal after oh, scandal. After scandal, after scandal, Man. after scandal, after scandal, after scandal, after scandal, after scandal, after scandal. Bruh, like seriously, like he is something wrong with this dude. I'm surprised it ain't nobody even got him locked up or at least going to jail or something like that. Like this this is ridiculous, yo. Like, I've never seen so much stuff 
pull it up in like a 30 minute segment of a clip on one person like every so-called scam that he just set up there and just said it's probably about anywhere from like 10 to 15 of them and i'm like this is crazy after scandal after scandal yeah, after scandal after scandal after Seriously. scandal after scandal now that begs the question where do we go from here because if i'm not mistaken revenge porn is punishable up to a year and a half in jail yeah, exactly. one year in jail depending on what state you happen to be in and given his track record what kind of defense would antonio brown have if his child's mother decides to take it to the law and take him to court Will this be the end of Antonio Brown, at least for 12 to 18, possibly 24 months, whatever the case may be? I'm very, very, very disturbed by his actions over the course of the past yeah. four years. Because we make jokes, right? I, myself included, have made jokes regarding CTE, things of these different, you know, sort of nature. But mm. the reality of it is kind of terrifying. Because if you see somebody's life spiraling downwards, you see somebody's life crumbling before our eyes, they're just completely falling apart and contributing heavily to themselves, yeah. self-sabotaging their future. And it seems as if there's no end in sight. Because let's just be honest, every time you see news of Antonio Brown, you think to yourself, it can't get worse than this, right? And then it gets worse. It gets worse. It never ends. So then once again, I'll pose the question to individuals who are in his circle, people who are his friends. What is the day-to-day -day conversation like with AB? Because again, And I know one thing he's going to get at too is why is they not really saying anything to him? Because that... that Oh, man, if I were a friend of him, I'd be like, dude, why are you doing this shit, yo? Like, why are you wilding? I've been done, I've been done told him that. I've been done asked him that and everything. Like, why are you doing this? Like, chill, bruh. Like, just chill. Like, you sitting up here, you're an established football player. Decided not to play no more, you know, for the time being. Come on, man! Like, just stop, just stop. And it's like he, and then it's like he, somewhat being an attention whore in a certain, a certain sense. And it's like you don't need that much attention. Like, you're AB. AB is just you know, by the name by itself, it speaks for itself. But you don't need to throw negative, negative stuff on top of that. Like, it don't make any sense. Again, he's a grown man. He gonna do whatever the hell it is that he wanna do. Yeah. But if this, this is somebody who you genuinely love, this is somebody who you genuinely respect, is there nobody who can talk to him? Because it comes to a point where when you see mistake after mistake after mistake after mistake after mistake, misstep after misstep after misstep, controversy, scandal, whatever the case may be, there's a common denominator, and that's A.B. Somebody got to talk to this brother. Like I said a couple years ago, it was funny with the whole enough from the clown and everything of that nature. But now, like, brother got five kids. He got five kids. Yeah. And his kids got to experience this. You're watching your father do things to your mother. Remember, there was the whole domestic violence situation where he was evicting her out of the house. Then the candy dicks sort of situation happened. Now this revenge porn situation happening. And you're a child. You've got yourself, you got toddlers. I believe his youngest is about three, four years old. His really? oldest being about 11, 12, you know, somewhat years old. And all of this is unfolding before your eyes, right? And I believe there's two child's mothers. So I think his oldest two may not be with uh, um, the youngest three's, you know, mother. But whatever the case may be, you're watching all of this unfold. And your father was a man who was revered by millions upon millions of people exactly. and then we get to this point 
So what happens for Antonio Brown? Because thoughts and prayers can only go so far. I think there needs to be an intervention from his peers, but not just, you know, former teammates or things like that. It has to be his friends who step in and save this brother. Because like I said before, I fear where this leads moving forward. Because it's... And I just said that, like, where's his friends at like his friends ought should have stepped in should have said something about that but then again this is ab we're talking about he probably burned them bridges to kingdom come he probably done burned them set fire to them probably rebuilt another bridge and probably burnt that down too for all we know like that or i don't know what to say about this dude it seems as if it gets worse and worse and worse and worse and worse and worse and soon enough there's only so much of your reputation as a b the all pro you know mm -hmm. would be future hall of fame wide receiver would be. now artists where more people tune in more for the debauchery and the debacle and the circus to your music rather than actually the lyrics and wanting to see your music career succeed true, where does true. it end i don't know man it's 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 one of those situations where i kind of look at it and say i'm i'm disappointed and i'm also a bit fearful about what things look like moving forward for ab because now it's it's getting to a point now when you look in comment sections and you see people like hey man oh, are you doing king yeah man i love to see it Woo, keep striving keep being you yeah we love to see like at one point are people gonna be real and authentic with this brother man at what point are people gonna step in and stop this man from doing what it is that he's doing because okay there's another thing i know i keep pausing but yeah there's another thing too that he just touched on like i don't get why a whole bunch of people are actually like co-signing on this stuff like just like he was saying when they're gonna actually just come out and just be like bro you like you acting plain stupid for doing what you're doing or whatever like that but then again at the same time it's like a give or take they probably sit up there and comment all that stuff but is he gonna listen no you know because there's been plenty of times he just he just don't give a care about authority you know coaches policemen anything dealing with you know with security hospitality and everything like that you know dealing you know it's everything like that he, he don't he does not care for authority and he just feel like he can just sit up there and just do whatever he wants in the short term at 32 33 whatever age it might be 32 33 34 whatever the case may be he's still relatively young 20 years from now when he's 50 all of the mistakes that he had made now will continue to haunt him in 20 years from now there's people who've made com complete turnarounds in that time but we don't need to wait until that time to have the turnaround happen we can have that happen right now Exactly. So this is a cry for help to his friends and family, individuals who love and respect this brother. And he also has that same sort of feeling towards you. Please help this brother. Please, Please. help. Because Please. It's, it's, it's getting ridiculous, as DeMarcus Cousins would say. It's getting ridiculous. It's really ridiculous. Yes, man. It's, this is ridiculous, man. Look out! Behind you! <laughs> <laughs> He did have an ending like that. But in all seriousness, somebody help that brother, man. I, I don't know if you got to get a hose and, and spray him with holy water or something, but some got to happen. You're never going to catch me. You're wasting your time. Forget about it. You mean to tell me you watched the entire video, but you haven't subscribed? Yeah, something's up with that dude, for real, for real. I, I, I can't. He needs some serious help. Yeah. Not ever gonna stretch this out any longer, but yeah, just I hope there's some help for him. I really do. Real fan of of AB, but yeah, he needs he needs some serious help for real, for real. Well, further ado, this is Bob signing off.
be prepared for another reaction video later on today. About this thing. Everybody out there be safe and please, please, please keep your mental in check because apparently a certain someone doesn't feel like he's how would I say mentally stable he feels like he is but it's somewhere down the line something's wrong with him I pray for him but he needs some serious help other than that I'm out this thing peace